All right, so the point of this video will be to hopefully keep myself on track while correcting and fixing bugs in a current game I'm working on called Tajimi no Ippo Lollapalooza on Roblox. And this sort of this sort of type of video of course can be used for other games I'm working on. But the main issue I have right now is with Hajime no Ippo. <sighs> okay, so this game uh was sort of the main project I've been working on for the longest. So I sort of you know, just for context, I started scripting for this game. So I basically went from scratch to my current set of knowledge now. So as I've learned, I sort of, you know, as I, as my knowledge grew, the game grew. And of course, that's going to leave, <laughs> that's going to leave certain things outdated compared to, you know, more recent things that have been added more recently. So, you know, same thing with the map itself, not just the code. So, and, you know, more recently, I've abandoned, not abandoned this game, but, you know, I haven't been giving it the love it deserves, especially for the people that want to see you know more from it and you know that's not fair to them for me to just abandon what they were hoping in you know so point of this video fix up the game document it hopefully help someone who's maybe newer to coding than I am and to keep myself on track with developing the game itself so yeah let's get started um, main issues with the game are, you know, the, the general, <laughs> the general clunkiness of the entire thing itself, you know, some things I definitely have to work on from scratch, basically, you know, some things are definitely not optimized again, I've worked on it from scratch, but immediately off the bat, one issue is the animations. Very recently, Roblox did something with animation priority and how certain keyframes mix based off of priorities. And so, most things I have to fix. Right now, the left jab, which I'm doing right now, and some of the right, the right hooks and straights are definitely not looking correct based off of what I've animated them to be. So we're going to fix that right now. All right, let's see, let's see. Uh, kind of spoiled myself on the answer, but again, this is for helping others as well as myself. But uh, main issue was changing in how they handled priority. So recently, well not recently, but you know, what Roblox did was change how certain priorities mix, which I, which I just said, I think. So I recently had them on, had most attacks all on a priority of movement while uh, they were also, I also had idle animations on movement and now they're, they're a mess. So without this, the, the script itself, not the script itself, but you know, the animation would look very different. And so I'll show that now because that's what it is in game if someone tried to join right now. Ah, uh, okay, publish. Again, I I don't know for certain things. I definitely could have done them differently. You know, going back over it when your mind isn't fresh on what you're working on. You know, some scripts can definitely 
and some systems that you built for yourself you know at the moment they'll be like oh wow like i completely understand this this is i'll never need help with uh working on this or coming back to it but then you know you give like a week break and then i think my internet went out <laughs> that's fine you'll you'll see the point regardless but um but yeah some systems just they just are not as good as you think they are when you're working on them in the moment so if possible check <laughs> check with someone else who's maybe on equal or better level than you make sure they give that a test say hey this is actually kind of confusing to look at but anyway anyway um yeah animations are definitely this is what they are in game right now for someone or anyone to join the game and play um definitely not this is this is the animation for dodging backwards it's like dodging forward, so the idol is definitely not uh it's definitely not working as intended. So I know the fix. I know the fix. Now which is the priority. So click here to modify. That's pretty new actually, but whatever. Okay, so as far as I can tell, the one fix would be setting basically every priority to action uh, for attacks which is fine uh, another way you could do this I'm doing this through scripts would be to just go through every single animation in uh, in the uh, studio menu you know when you're actually uh, saving and working on the animations themselves which is it's not fun you know going through each one because you have to click this uh, import from Roblox and you know a lot of these animations are very old so I'd have to scroll through all this or find the animation ID and then like this is the one for the left jab so I'd have to like go here dot 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 animation priority set it to action resave it so I will do that eventually that is the best course of action you know for consistency but for now I'm going to set them in script because I type faster than I can do that uh, so I guess while I do this I can definitely discuss, I guess, more so anything else that, uh, you know, that needs to be talked about. If I can multitask. Oh man, maybe I can't. <laughs> uh, let's see. But, alright. Let's, uh, let's get some things worked on here so some things discussed about some things worked on so the reason again I'm making this is because of the fact that you know I have been sort of ghosting the game uh, I've said it before through discord although I'm not very good at you know keeping tabs on the actual discord I made so I'll say it here that you know uh this is my this is basically will always be my main project you know hopefully I've put so much uh, I don't want to say money well I guess I have put in money money time effort you know this is the game I wanted to code for in the first place you know and that holds a special place in your heart after a few years you know going from a basic base plate to a fully developed map thanks to Houdini or Dini who underscore Dini on Roblox I don't think he has any other <laughs> any other connections really 
but definitely look that guy up. He's my main builder. He does most of the building for all my games, actually. Dude is amazing at what he does. So if you need a builder, then definitely hook that man up. Look that man up. He's your guy. Uh, but yeah. Uh, it's you know when you develop uh games as like I mean I don't get paid you know I look at a game concept or you know at this at the time of at the time of recording you know One Piece games are like the thing right now so so I've heard so I've seen but you know you look at a game or you look at a show and you say like man there's like there's nothing like this that's out right now and it's a shame you know uh i look at a show or an old game i used to play ooh excuse me hiccups or an old game i used to play and i say wow man like it would be amazing if there was like a ro like a free Roblox game I could get on right now and just mess with the settings or like a one-to-one -one copy on Roblox that would be that would be pretty amazing is what I usually think of and you know for that case the only restriction is you know yourself and how much you know and how much you're able to do or you know how well you're able to do it to go out there and share and you know when I first made the game when I first had ideas for making the game uh, this game here it's a uh, you know the thoughts going through your mind it's like wow man like I wish there was a boxing game on Roblox you know there there might be row boxing and you know there might be uh, a few mighty omegas and Ken Ganashras you know going around but you know something specifically for Hajime no Ippo specifically you know the best boxing anime uh, objectively objectively then you know you gotta you gotta do it and uh... one thing I've learned is uh... you know you're you're really if you go out there and make something that you know you really like like maybe you say like oh man there's no Roblox games for this show man that means there there can't be that many fans on Roblox you you gotta get rid of that mindset because uh, there are definitely more of your allies than you think that you know they have the same mindset as you where they go like man the th <laughs> like the thought cuz i've been on both sides you know it's like the thought process is like oh man there's no there's no um there's no good bleach games out oh well and you know you just go about your day or like oh man there's no good there's no good avatar the last airbender games and like you know you just leave it at that or you go like oh man if only there was uh, an Avatar The Last Airbender game uh, on Roblox and you know people just leave it at that you know you, you don't really know how to code well, what is going on right now you know you don't really know how to code uh, uh, oh, because I'm silly that's why uh, but you know just an idea just the idea of having the game itself like someone is working on it can really bring up people's morale about what is soon to come you know what i mean it's like uh uh what's the what's the name of the game there's another hajime no ipo game in development probably hopefully right now as we speak um like Hajime Rising I think some of the combat got leaked in this like basically a base plate all the game is is a ring 
from what my friend explained to me, you know, uh, which is a shame it got leaked. But I think, okay, I'm not, I'm not going to say like, oh, we are the only people making games for this show. Of course, there's there are plenty of uh, other games from far before ours where, you know, the main idea was Hajime no Ippo. And uh, people just wanted to make a quick something or maybe they wanted to make an entire game but got limited by how much they knew about coding which is a shame like you can you can definitely tell the games where you go out and you know <laughs> maybe they spent some time in the toolbox you know like 15 minutes in the toolbox maybe 20 minutes off of YouTube videos looking up you know how to make a punching animation how come other people can't see my punching animation you know, how come only I can see how much damage they take and then, you know, they give up coding. But, you know, the, uh, it really is a shame that they're limited by, you know, how much they have learned so far. And, you know, if some of those ideas got out, it's like, man, it, these games could be really good. Like, uh, there was this one Hunter Hunter game where the map was amazing. The map was phenomenal. Um, I don't even remember the dude's Roblox name, but it was this Hunter Hunter map where I was actually blown away. Like, there was so much to, uh, to explore, but, you know, you could tell that it might not have been the best point in their knowledge when it came to uh when it came to scripting they definitely had the building down but the scripting was just not there at least not to uh to something that you could where you could visualize what you want to do which can be frustrating very frustrating i know that firsthand but yeah man like some games are just the map some games are like like wow this test this combat test is amazing but where is like where's the map you know like it can go both ways or like oh man uh the premise for this game is cool but where are the animations like you know like you know some people value animations more which you know maybe maybe that's high value maybe it's not i don't know um but it definitely takes talent for animations at least to get like what you want to convey across uh fluently but yeah okay well uh first off let me just say uh i guess the animations are fixed for now so all right let's just summarize this right now and then I guess I'll just talk about you know what I was just talking about along with what the next video will be because this one will be about fixing you know actually no this one can be longer because I have different combat styles I, I honestly forget how much I worked on this game so this is just the orthodox the orthodox stance which you know again has to get reworked eventually um but you know, there's Hitman, there's Hitman, and there's uh oh man, I don't even remember. We just, we just, you know, it won't be complex. Uh, I wasn't even explaining what I was doing. I, it was literally just changing the priority of every combat animation. That's all it was. That's all I was doing while I was rambling. Uh, so I'll do the same thing for Hitman right now. But, um, but yeah, man, I guess the whole point of what I was talking about was just, you know, as you, as these ideas come out, you know, you, you know, you have this idea like, oh man, I want to make an amazing Hunter Hunter game. It's, it's really a shame, man. Oh man. Let me just, let me just. Uh, go over something and, and you know 
sometimes you feel like you miss out on certain things or certain games or certain uh, communities. Like I joined, like for example, I joined Team Fortress 2 kind of late. Like I only got, <laughs> I only got a Steam account uh, to play like Unturned, you know, that free zombie survival game. Uh, like I only got a Steam account to like play that game like a few years ago like 2010s I think and uh, I only <laughs> was able to run TF2 like fluently since like 2018 around there so you know it's like you missed out on a lot of the community and then you look at all the animations all the all the people talking about this and that it's like dang man I wish I was there you know for when stuff was actually going down and it's the same thing for Hunter Hunter Worlds. If you don't know about Hunter Hunter Worlds, it is downright one of the best fighting games on Roblox. Uh, I really got to give it to that game. I'm really, I am, I got to admit, bro, I'm jealous. I'm jealous of, uh, of how well that dude has made his combat system, how well he's made his maps. Um, not just Hunter Hunter games, right? Because there's only been so many Hunter Hunter games, right? And of those, there's only been so many that are good. You know, like, all right, you, like every game is good as in its own way. You know, some Hunter Hunter games or some games in general are going to be base plates. You know, and then like some of them are going to be like, wow, okay, this has combat. But, you know, there's, like, infinite combos if you really wanted to do that, you know. Like, uh, there was a few games, you know. The the average life cycle of a Hunter Hunter game right now in 2022 is, like, the game drops. There's a Discord for it. It's hyped for, like, a week, and then it dies. Like, you check back to the game, there's, like, three people playing. Which, again, is unfortunate. Uh, and maybe I'll explain that in a later video about why games die and how unfortunate it is for the developer but um but yeah it's like that game not just hunter hunter games like the combat in that game is like the best to date that i've seen in like any roblox game i, I really can't think of a game that does combat better like you know between stats uh mixing up hatsus mixing up abilities from races stats from races passive abilities from your race and your class uh dodging parrying uh sliding and being able to customize your own m1s it's like that game did something right and like armor attack damage and, you know, the game may have, like, only, like, 15 players at a time, right? But, you know, of course, compared to, like, you know, Shindo Life, oh, yeah, yeah, like, you know, it'll have, like, thousands of players at a time. But, you know, you know, it's kind of like TF2 in that way, right? Team Fortress 2, where it's like, okay, sure, the the numbers may not be as great as some other game like Fortnite consistently but there is a reason why the number is not zero daily players you know what I mean it's like uh, the game definitely did something right it's like you'll play the game you know like oh man you know like we got pretty high level get bored you know like you know maybe find another game to play and then you'll come back and you'll be like man this is like objectively better and more fun. It's like, why did I even like get bored of it in the first place sort of a thing, you know? Uh, and, you know, it's not a bad thing to get bored with the game, you know? That's how that's how certain things go, you know? It's like, I love Team Fortress 2. I main medic, right? Uh, but just because I like a game doesn't mean, you know, 
you can't just like, you know what, I've had my fair fill of TF2 for a while, let me hop on something else, like, you know, there are Minecraft heads, and then there are people that are like, you know, let me play Minecraft multiplayer with my friends for a bit, and you know, like, let's just, <laughs> let's just, uh, leave the game for like a good three or four months, maybe get back on later, it's that sort of a thing, you know, and, uh, same thing with that game, but only very recently did the game die because the game stopped working. Like, I don't even think you can get past the main menu right now. Uh, and it just happened so suddenly. I was like, wow, I really like I really do have love for that game, man. It's a it's a shame. It's really it really is a shame. I hope he uh, he at the very least, you know, I don't know what's going on with their personal life. You know, people are busy, like, you know, you can't just demand these things, you know, people have lives outside of Roblox, you know, but, you know, it really is one of the best games, like, period, like, in basically all aspects, um, and, uh, but yeah, it's, you know, like, what was I, what was I going with this? Point is, uh, man, I was not working on anything while I was doing this. Uh, I guess that's just your, your lecture for the video. But, yeah, you know, it was just a, it's just a tragedy. I hope that game gets worked on again. Uh, cause there definitely will be a community for it. Um, but yeah. Anyway, back to what I was doing. The priority of animation. Uh, shouldn't be, shouldn't even be that hard to finish up here. Okay, this is for Hitman. Whoa, what in the world? Okay, that's fine, whatever. But, I think I only have for this game right now, like, three, or more so, ooh, getting hiccups. <laughs> Excuse me. That's why, that is why. Clan Shadow Track. There we go. Uh, Orthodox of Shadow Party. But I only have like two and a half, basically. Uh, Orthodox. Uh, Hitman, which is what I'm working on right now, the animations. And. What else? What was it? Sawamura's? Sawamura's Bullet Jab? I think I was working on, or was it. What was it called? Oh, Peekaboo, that's what it was. Peekaboo. I have. I, you know. Again. You you leave an idea or a project alone long enough, and at least me anyway, and you'll definitely forget, <laughs> you know, exactly where you left off. It'll definitely leave your mind after a while. Um, and I guess that's only being human. At the very least, the computers remember where I was. So i got to be thankful for that. Uh, but... Yeah, you know, looking at how long this video is going to be, it's definitely, ooh, it's going to be a monster to upload. Hope it doesn't take too much space on the computer. Uh, okay. But, yeah, you know, for context, I think I've been developing on Roblox... Maybe since I had my old laptop, I think the very first time I touched studio was uh <laughs> was uh back when I was playing this uh this tragedy of a story. You know, the game is solid. Final chapter. It's a one piece game. Very old one piece game. Like y'all youngsters do not know anything about that game, bro. Uh, no, PBB on top, I must, gotta get that out there, but, uh, 
but yeah it was when most of the crew most of my crew you know we uh we were like man <laughs> you know back to what i was saying again like man we should make a one piece game you know back when one piece games were kind of an original idea you know there were only so many that were good you know um now you you can't really leave the front page without seeing a good one piece game which is in multiple ways a good thing and a bad thing but uh that's for another day uh you know it's like we were like yeah man i'm kind of good at animation yeah and like yeah man i'm you know i i've been in studio before like you know i got a cousin and i helped him in in studio once and it's like yeah man we should we should definitely make a one piece game <laughs> and so like five of us spent like one afternoon in studio making uh making this one piece game man quote unquote has the default bandits you can get off of the toolbox uh running scripts day and night cycle a weather cycle apparently <laughs> the map we made ourselves with you know stuff from the toolbox but you know <laughs> again limited by what you by what you are capable of and how much you know the curse of humanity of course but uh but yeah that was the first game i ever worked on and then you know it's funny because you come back to the game and it's like bro oh my lord like why is there <laughs> you know you come back with context of how scripting works and you know like you have more experience with it as a whole and you're like wow what like what were we actually doing sort of a thing i think i'm the one that uploaded the game to their account um i don't think anybody else has the copy anymore i think they can join it for sure but i think i i have the original copy of the game but uh <laughs> you know uh it's like there's five copy and pasted scripts for like day and night cycle and they all do the exact same thing you know you join the game you you like instantly start lagging you know you know it's a good game the game has heart when you instantly start lagging the second you join uh <laughs> but yeah uh let's see hitman how simple is that to do let's see okay whoa yeah something is definitely not right here what if i press e Oh man. Alright, well, perfect. Because there's definitely something wrong with this uh this idle animation. Something very blatantly wrong. Okay, well, you know, the idle my my fault, not the idle. The idle itself looks fine. The issue is, you know, for one the left jab. I looks like I'm scratching my stomach or something. I don't know. I don't know what that is. If anything, the right cross is like too quick. Uh, this, the animation for that, you know, is uh, <laughs> definitely looks a bit silly. That is not right. So, yep, let's fix that too before I end this video because it is getting long. And I do want to be able to upload it to Roblox. Maybe. Whoa, to YouTube, I'm sorry. You know, maybe show some of my friends, you know, not to flex. You know, because I did promise them I would record fixing the game. Who knows, maybe they'll even listen to it while working on their games. Because I do have some people who are game developers as well. Okay, let's just publish both of these. Blind faith, blind faith. Let's just hope I did things right. Uh, let's see here. Action. How many of these? All right. That looks about right. These all look about right. 
Alright. The priorities are all for the tracks, not anything else, no other errors. So, what did I do wrong? Uh, let's see. So, this function called lefts are for any time you left click in when fighting. However, let's see, liver blow, adjust speed, let's see, that's R, so that's the cross attack, hitman flicker, uh, just, I'm just checking the script here for when they actually play to see, uh, you know, if I change manually the priority of uh, of the animations after I have changed them up top at the start of the script but it looks like I have not so let's see okay in the function called lefts we are going to do a little testing so the combo so you know there's ca ooh excuse me there are combos in the game right so there's left right left left right so you know these are just for any combos that look like left 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 left, left la, 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 you know so we're just going to print uh what was what does that stand for hitman left jab you know, they make sense in your mind, not to people on the outside. Uh, <laughs> so we're just going to print the priority for the left jab. And this is when the combo resets. So it'll play the exact same thing. You know, I don't know why I didn't just put this as the same thing if the scripting is exactly the same. Can I do that? Is that fine? The combo is uh do most uh wow, well, I guess I can do that. I don't know why I didn't. Or combo equals yeah, then then I can just get rid of this. Yay, I saved myself like what is that? Eight lines? Alright. Uh let's just hope that that doesn't completely break the script. But I got it. I probably I probably know what to do. Uh which comes with experience by the way. You know, some things you can't learn off of a YouTube video and get instantly. Uh all right. What what was the term for this? You know, I didn't really exactly go to school for for scripting here. What? No, it looks fine. Huh, wait. No, it doesn't. That looks good. Q. That looks better. R. Oh, wow. These actually look fine now. I don't even know what. You know what? I think it was just because I. <laughs> Man. I think it was just because I switched. Uh... It's just an issue with. You know, not really with any of the code itself, really. It's not the code's fault. Also, that's that's lesson number one. That is lesson number one for coding in Studio or coding in Unity. Well, I don't know about Unity because I never used it. But uh, you know, it is a wise man once said, "I am wise dread." That it is never Studio's fault. It's never Studio fault. It is always yours. Uh, it's just a computer. It does what you want. If something is not working. It is never like, oh man, like something in studio is broken. That rarely happens, in my experience anyway. It's either the script itself does not work, like there's something in it that crashes, or it is something that you have not seen where you know maybe this part of the code isn't actually running when I think it is or you know maybe it's running more than once uh, or maybe I accidentally set it to 5 instead of 10 
or 2 million instead of 2.00 you know uh, these things happen and it's only it's only a part of the learning process uh, let's see what other animations do I need to I think this is fine actually you know left right left left you know to be fair the flicker in, in in my mind was uh, a lot simpler when I was working on it I guess I gotta add moves to it later uh, what am I forgetting here oh I think this is actually I think this is done okay so I guess I can end the video here uh, let's see final final words of wisdom for the first part of this video let's see uh more to come i'm sorry for you know to all the people that are you know i i have you know not to not to spook you all but i do indeed have uh like a private bot that lets me know you know it lets me know how many people join the game like daily so you know there's I definitely see that there's at least some people you know like I guess the mindset is like you know oh, like you know there are hundred minute Weibo games you know like let me let me see or like you know let me just spam open like five hundred minute Weibo games when I look it up and you know I'll just play them all like you know that's my thought process anyway you know I I see something I want to play I, or like a game or like a show like oh wow there are roblox games for it let's let's see how they did and you just open up a bunch and just play them all just <laughs> just see what's fun what you can get uh what you can get your friends to join uh and you know i'd imagine you know they play for a second uh the thought process might be like wow you know this is a pretty big map maybe they put some you know, another issue is that people don't exactly know how to fight in this game. Uh, to go into like sort of the fighting stance or the fighting pose, you press control. Uh, and a lot of people can't get past that first hurdle, so I gotta add a way for uh, people to figure out how to play. Uh, a lot of people are on mobile, so you know, and I never did touch mobile settings or <laughs> or things for this game. You know, that might be another barrier, but that's something to work on. Uh, but yeah, sorry. To all the people who were, you know, that are in the Discord or, you know, like, oh man. That, like, you know, the you, literally, like, the, the day ones, bro. I'm, I'm sorry. Sorry for, uh, for abandoning the game for so long. Right now, I think Houdini has told you all, I, I'm really not good at managing Discords just not my thing anymore that uh you know i'm currently working on a kaiji game you know it's just caught my fancy at the moment and you know i i i wish i could pick my brain as to why i'm choosing that to work on over this when you know i've worked on this longer and there are more people there for it but you know that's just the main thing i don't even think i can fight it and i'm not going to fight it you know, like, of course I'll work on this. This will always be my main project. But, uh, yeah. Sorry again. Just know that the game is still being worked on. Even if I'm, even if you see, like, last updated, like, a month, you know, it's still gonna be my main game. It's, like, the game I have the most progress in. Uh,. You know the game I know the most about so you know it's not going anywhere and I'm gonna be working on it and uh, you know look forward to it and I guess think of this video as an apology too so yeah all right uh, I'll just keep pressing buttons so I figure out which one was to stop and uh, more videos like this soon